Hello viewers, if you play League of Legends, you may have asked yourself, should I play Bard? And today I will be answering that question for you. At the time of this video, Bard currently has the lowest win rate in the game, coming in at a measly 39.2%, rocking one of the lowest win rates for any League of Legends champion ever. And I fucking love this champion. For me, Bard is literally about just fucking trolling your team. I mean, I don't know what drugs they were on when they designed this guy, but Morello passed me that because it must have been some good shit. Alright, so how about we make a support who, um, leaves his marksman alone in bot lane while he runs around the map. Okay, so you're thinking of a champion that actively supports their jungler and ganks the other lanes to show support all around the map instead of just bot lane, creating more diverse gameplay in League of Legends? No, he goes on a magical journey and picks up Pikmin that make him slightly stronger. That's fucking genius! And let's talk about Bar's abilities for a second. His ult literally lets you kill your teammates at your convenience. His magical journey could be used as a versatile tool to get your team around the map and... <laughs> fucking magical journey. <laughs> I fucking love Bard. You're literally just this guy that fucking flies around the map and picks up shit and says, fuck my team. <laughs> Alright, so as you may have been able to tell, it wasn't very responsible to give me a champion like Bard. If you want my actual thoughts on how good he is, he's pretty fucking garbage tier. But my favorite aspect of League is fucking with my teammates. Gameplay. 6 out of 10. It's incredibly fun to just fuck with your team, but when they kick you from the Skype call, or <clears throat> in real life if you're sitting next to them, it's not as fun. His actual usefulness right now is non-existent, so I can't give his gameplay a higher score even though he's incredibly fun to play. Looks, 8 out of 10. I'm all about that Miyazaki-inspired shit, looks fucking amazing. And my personal enjoyment, which is the only score that matters. 10 out of 10. Should you play Bard? Yes. Bard is the best way to break friendships. That's the end of Should You Play Bard. Thank you all for supporting me and starting this new series on my channel. The turnout has been amazing and I have a lot of fun making these. By the way, the next full AP is Shaco, in case you're wondering. And since I didn't do any real life stuff for this video, instead of the outtakes, here's a remix of me and Kiari making noises. <laughs>